Welcome back, comrades. Today we will leave the winter. Surprise, surprise. Um, finish up crime and justice system. Hopefully have enough educated people. And um, start the farming season. So let's get on with it. Okay, nice. We are here. Uh, we have started our one of the most important buildings in the new upcoming, more improved Soviet society uh, prison. It's also kind of a landmark, not a positive one in our totally fine boxy city. <laughs> yeah, it's a functional one. Uh, this is um, just to emphasize this point. The city is built for functionality, not for beauty. Uh, we start with little money and we need to simply make it work and not make it beautiful. Um, beautiful costs time to think about it. Um, it also costs um, more space. So it is a very space efficient one. Um, it's planned around the water supply basically. So water supply then switch is the smallest radius you can have. If everything is uh, served by water and sewage, everything will be in walking range. So um, to only have the smallest amount of infrastructure here to support our city, we make it work. Uh, sorry, um, we make it work with the tools we are giving. Okay. So. I think everything is in a good state. We can start our time. Hmm. Industry is making us money, which is quite important. We are on low money state. Yeah, in our uh, constrained existence of keeping, staying away from loans. Um, we have finished our farm. So. My farm setup, as I told you, uh, if we plant it, is uh, 444. So uh, for for uh, tractors, yeah, that's uh, how they are calling them. Uh, for harvesters and uh, for for uh, cover tools, <laughs> holes or hulls, cover tools. Um, yeah, farming trucks. Which can, if you have good material, uh, you can, if you have super good material, you can serve uh, for medium fields and after that 12 big fields. If you have good material but not the best one, you can serve uh, 12 medium fields. So four by every slot gets three fields. Um, and if you have uh, not so good material like in our situation, I ran with uh, four medium fields at the start of the sowing season and um, after that eight big fields. So uh, every one of these slots will get its three fields, but uh, yeah, we need to constrain ourselves and adjust to the situation we are thrown into. Let's look at the tractors. Um, sowing, yeah. So, like I said, the best one would be this one, which is a modded one. It's awfully for fast. Um, it's <laughs> more than two times faster than one of these tractors, but uh, and you pay for them with uh, with money, so it's okay. So it's he is uh, more than two times faster, but he is more than uh, yeah, nearly ten times, not not as much, but nearly ten times. Is costly. This one, it's even more cheaty because he's not so uh, cost intensive. So uh, let's get this <laughs> this ball rolling. One, two, three, four. Pray to the gods of the border post that uh, our tractors arrive. Tractor fleet, please. Tractor fleet. 
If I missed them, are they on the way? God damn it. Yeah. So we uh, buy our tractors at the border because it's more safe. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Spending more money than we need to, but hey. It's not that we are here on uh, quite competitive mode. <laughs> well, we have no money. Um, I also, I know where I will buy my uh, combines. Not at the farm, comrade. Oh, skipped one too much. So let's return. Here we are. Maybe you went up, end up with eight, but I don't think so. It's a complex game for sure, and uh, there's really not an easy thing to keep this one running and uh, stable and everything but man oh man sometimes the quality uh, amazes me Get, let them uh, be always fueled up the second option would be to use a distribution office connected uh, and uh, selecting all the fields uh, having basically more machinery in the farm and then uh, the the collection of the crops going separately but i don't like it i like to work with the farm as it is and um, max it out the good thing is oh, we need to auto assign them um, the good thing is if you work with medium farms for example um, and you max them out with 12 fields the placement of the fields is really easy you don't need to uh, have massive amounts of free space to place 12 fields so it's uh, easy to achieve uh, start with the small fields uh, go on with the big ones they work in the order they are selected so uh, first they work on this one and if he's finished hopefully he work on this one next one will go here and so on and so forth saving driving time yeah um, a medium farm is a nice point to have to be a really a sweet spot for me. So have a medium farm, a big silo connected to it. Um, it simply works. So if our four tractors arrive, we will have uh, four combine harvesters and four covered holes, hulls, <laughs> covered hulls. Um, yeah. And it will be fine. So let me check something okay we are fine good industry is running as expected we can check the numbers uh, how our important exports are doing um, we are now at under 100,000 ruble again um, as long as we are not under 50,000 ruble I'm not completely worried. The good thing is uh, if our ruble run down uh, we don't get into super trouble because uh, our <laughs> our energy comes from the opposite side. Um, so not everything collapses. Yeah, we are uh, finishing up. Introducing. Let me see if we can grab the comrade from the western side. Because he is no longer needed. Also the comrade, uh, comrade snowplow can relax a little bit. So he was there for importing steel and uh, some other goods later on bricks from the border. Um, no, no, no. That's not good. Rest here. Um, I wanted to support simply our efforts to get the 
bricks faster in. People are here. We are waiting for our cranes. So now we can see the border on, uh, yeah, on high gears. And I said it before, I'm uh, positively surprised how good this border post works. Um, I thought I will run into bigger problems having the smallest one. But uh, it seems that two loading bays are enough to uh, make the people which come in full and also uh, have them leave on a fast pace the border. The bigger borders have a big uh, way out and uh, this is what's stopping the, the comrades leaving and entering. Yep. So it's nice try which pays off. Uh, to give it a try. Yeah. Nearly 5000 workdays will be fast enough uh, once the bricks are delivered. Maybe we get some cranes in. No, we get bricks in. Um, this is why I wanted to speed up the brick thingy. We can uh, maybe ease off a little bit. He can help. Yes. Um, do we ease off maybe of the road construction? Hmm. Oh, these are also totally full. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> it's a temporary problem, but could be better. No. Uh, one bulldozer can go somewhere else. You go here. And you go here. There are ten comrades manning the... <laughs> yeah. Here's the crane. So now we are come from a work workforce of 10 to a workforce of maybe combined 80. Um, if the second train comes, we are at 155, 150 working power. Um, yeah, the work days will go down. Because we have nothing to do here in the ground phase, we can start this one also. Is the... Is this one done? Yeah, the road is done. Okay. Okay. We are tr still trying to educate everyone we can. Not very successful as I see. Um, is the number of educated people risen? Whoa! Yeah! 80! Welcome, comrades. So, uh, if these knuckleheads are showing up to go to work <laughs> somewhere else, um, we do not allow it. So, the sweatshop is made for very special people and uh, not for educated ones. Question is, who are the special people? But, yeah. Did you. Ah! It's already configured. It was configured this way. Let's hope so. Let's take a look. Sneak peek. Stop, stop, stop. Um. Yes, 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 yes. So, yeah. Uh, if uh, educated people, uh, highly trained and Soviet expert sh shows up here, um, he simply will wait and then search for another job. Maybe he goes to the pub as he should. As a worker. So nice, nice. We are over the hump. Uh, question is, <laughs> where are they? <laughs> and why, why they are they not showing up to work in the really important places? But yeah, nice. Let's hope our uh, yeah our medical system will not collapse. Meanwhile, it doesn't. Good, good, good. Yeah, really great news. Yep. 
Let me grab my tea. Three hundred tons. Lots of driving for our little to leave. Skodas. Backbone of our industrial might. Okay. This kindergarten is done. Um, it's connected, yes. So everyone can reach it. Up to where? It's rather strange way to reach it, but okay. Yeah. Not everyone, but everyone who needs them <laughs> can reach them. Why do you go this way? Don't we have a good connection here? We should have. So take it. This one is <laughs> subject for change. Okay, nice. Uh, winter is going away. So we can go on with our business. Do you have everything you have? No, you no, have no workers, which is okay. Have no trucks, which is okay. Too, <laughs> too late for sewing. I don't think so. It's rather too early for sewing. So let's decorate a little bit. Here we go. Um, make it look a little bit more like like a farm should look. Let's go for beaches. Um, make it a little bit farmlandy. Rows and rows of trees uh, separating the fields. A little bit sick and tired of our uh, industrial, functional, everything. We can do better, comrade. First we overplant a little bit, later we fix it to m let it look more a little bit structured and ordered and uh, hedgy. Some trees really go a long way in this game. And because we have three of everything, three pipes, uh, three... Uh, three times of three or four times types of trees are really enough comrade stop complaining I think it looks really nice in some places uh, in this automatically generated map also where the trees are uh, mixed subtly um, Yeah, and because we uh, have looked long enough on our functional state of our city, we also plaster in some trees here. It's 
So we will see what, what this effort will do. <laughs> Clean a little bit up afterwards, like I said. Um, have a city center, which looks like a city center, maybe. So my favorite construction material, gravel. Let's gravel up the place. Mm -hmm. Gravel, uh, you were here. Oh, uh, what? Where? Ah, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Do we, can we, should we? Start by deleting. Ain't needed no more. This one also, but a road between here and there would be nice. But this one needs to be constructed. You know what? Money, uh, money situation is not a good place. Maybe if I have finished uh, the crime and justice buildings, I will uh, make a short break and gravel up this road to the to the bus station because I really want to have something connecting this. Can go here. Comrades who don't uh, need to walk have short walking distances are happy comrades. Can get all your all their need done in their free time. Which is really important. No, no, no. Activate the grid. No, no. Okay. Here's an access to this one, which we don't need anymore. Sadly, the monuments don't burn. Okay. Okay, enough. Or maybe not. Hmm. We introduce pretty mode, maybe with Taylor's pretty mode. Yeah. This one needs people. No. So we are suffering because of the. Uh, Loss of construction materials. Let's look at our finances. Um, so we go here, we go last month. We have exported only 24 tons of uh, 24,000 rubles, which is quite low. Some things are disturbed here. Um, we have imported uh, for the production 4,000 tons of uh, 4,000 rubles of crops and. 4,000 rubles of uh, chemicals. Yeah. This was bad. Bad month. Uh, let's see last year. Bigger picture. So we have last year we have uh, exported half a million. Uh, a little bit more even. Uh, half a million ruble. Amount of ruble. Um, and. For th to produce this half a million, we had to buy 170,000 uh, 100, <laughs> 130, rubles of uh, fabric, and then later on we started with the crops business, so we imported 40,000, let's make it round 40,000, so we have 170,000. And uh, also we needed uh, chemicals to produce this whole shebang where the chemicals are here on the top. Yeah, also one, nearly 100,000 uh, ruble of chemicals, which tells me that the chemical plant is far more important than the crops production, but um, we had no option. <clears throat> 
to go to the chemicals uh, because our technical university needs to be uh, needs to start the research. Okay, so we have spent two hundred seventy thousand uh, to earn five hundred seventy thousand, uh, make a profit of three hundred k, which is nice and uh, it's totally enough. But we need to survive, mm. and this is what is critical at the moment. Uh, have enough cash on the bank and not build too fast, which we are certainly doing. So plowing has begun. Yeah. They have plowed the smallest ones now. Maybe someone is here, maybe don't. Uh, are you still here? No, you aren't. So he's uh, plowed completely and starts to grow. Uh, if he's plowed halfway, he doesn't start to grow. Uh, this is why the uh, medium fields on the start are really great for early harvest. So the little tractors uh, went to refuel, I think. Yeah, that's what I'm, to <laughs> what I'm talking about. We are on double speed anyway. Uh, this is travel time fiasco. Um, we could sneak in the road through here. Which is a good thing, I think. Or maybe next season if we... Oh, let's see. I don't want to cut into the field. More than it's needed. So, we'll go here. Ruining all the nice uh, forestry we done. You don't go. Please go. Hmm. Playing the game of chicken. Okay. Situation may be improved. Let's replant, uh, double down on our tree effort. Do this, give me that. Do this. Oh man, is it... It's not even funny how bad this looks, but only from this angle. So we don't look from this angle. <laughs> Plaster some trees over it and we'll be fine. Trees are really great for hiding the biggest sins in this game. Okay. So we are here. This one is done. Nice. Um, our road crew is really looking for jobs. Yeah. Good. We are on full speed here. Um, let's wait. Money situation. Oh, we are done here. <laughs> Comrades should need uh, need <laughs> something to drive on or not. Uh, let's buy the cheapest ones. Uh, another. Ooh. don't know what it means, but it looks snazzy. Start with the... Uh, with the justice building. can also shorten the travel time for our comrades to go to work here. The monuments start to look a little bit more reasonable as they became hidden by the trees. Also subject to uh, some road work. Uh, 
let's make the central place a central place. So we go. Oh, boom, 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 boom. go here. Have some gravel or have something else? Oh, gravel will be fine. Maybe we can leave some room for a tree or two. Let's see. Go like this. Go like that. Go like this. Oh, this is not nice. Don't like this one. Okay. Bye bye. Um, so we don't go with the road tool, we go with uh, the squarish tool. Just a little bit. Uh, adjustment of what I just did there was uh, by holding the Alt key, which is the only thing where you can reasonably lay out these things. Either you do this or you get a heart attack. Being constantly annoyed. This tool is funny enough, so don't make your life more complicated than it should be. Yes, yes, yes. A secret entrance is being used. Really nice. So, um, try to clean up this little place here. And... Get rid of it. So maybe some snow... Uh, some snow? Yeah. Some grass will come, but on the wrong, wrong place. Nice comrade. Um, Okay. Have true have some trees. Oh, not here. Mm. Misfired. Um Yeah. And here. Okay. Make the best use of the small tools we have giving. Has felt this area a little bit up. I always use the roads as a, a, as a place of constraint, so uh, it looks good. Go with, <laughs> like I said, uh, the tools are very sparse we have given here, so a uh, lot of room for creativity. Go back to the gravel. Give me the road like tool or the path like tool. Nah, it's too much space here. So, pull in a gravel path here. Something like this one. Ah, no, we need to go all the way. Following the road a little bit. Okay. Fix this. Fix this with asphalt or gravel. I think uh, first make it straight. Let's 
straight uh Okay. And fix the last one with this fight. Uh what? No, I want to scratch one please. Okay. Yep. Some variation of color uh, comes in nicely with the uh, uh, <laughs> the crappy road here. Which we can fix. How much wood do you have? 3.2 tons. Let's wait for your comrade and fix this one. Okay, there's a comrade. Fix it, we shall. Highest priority. Let's hope somebody gets the job, gets the call. Looks good. Uh, need people. Thank you. Okay. Well, here we are retooling along. It's totally nice. This one is going along. <laughs> a little bit faster, comrades are working, uh, building by hand their new future of crime and justice. Let's give our uh, police station a little bit of fuel. Fuel distribution here. And here. Yeah. The crime situation is really not good. It's in some cases here. And we do the cases and then we let them out of the street again. There's other... Are we on time? So the cases are waiting here? Until they uh, pass on? Interesting. Okay. I have never played, uh, to be honest, without a... Uh, so... <laughs> maybe we can start to go on max here. Uh, oh, 70 was the max. Uh, never have played without the judge... Judge... Uh, justice. Uh, so I always play to have a complete justice system and not a half back one. So yeah, okay. Now the cases are here. And we need some comrades to uh, get to work. Please. Let's go to our smart house and tell them also to pay some attention to here. Um, should be okay. Let's connect the Justice House a little bit better to our uh, fantastic network. Make it like this. Yeah. Or not? Hmm. Maybe a little bit shorter. So taking a little bit inspiration by the round curve of this uh, wonderful cinema. I really love the old blocky one, which is, was not so bad after all. Just like a little bit so. This one looks like hard corner for the criminals. Nice. So, yeah, starting to <laughs> get into dangerous territory of beautification mode. Uh, yeah, leaving the realm of functio functionality completely. Uh, okay, why not? 2000 workdays, people are waiting to get their uh, feet wet, asses kicked, conviction convicted. Justice done. Yeah. So, uh, <laughs> they cannot. 
they cannot uh, mourn because there's no police, now there's no justice. Um, do we start this one? Ouch. Ouchie, ouchie, ouch. Do we actually produce something? No, we don't. What's going on? What's going on? Energy. No fabric. We have clothes. No chemicals. Water quality. No, 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 no. Eighty-five percent, comrade. You need eighty-five percent. Oh, this is no good. This, this is really an emergency situation because uh, no money, no water, no nothing. We've locked ourselves here royally. Out. <laughs> okay. First order of business, uh, we switch to fabric. So, you are loading, no, no, fabric, you will unload, yes, you will load this, you will also unload fabric, yes, and we need to change your loadout, so let's Reset this one. You're running around with crops. Okay. Oh, yeah. Mm. The border, please unload also crops and chemicals. We don't load them here so they can empty out. Yes. So you can now carry everything. And we need to open all your comrades also and check if what they are carrying you are done. You can carry nothing what we need, so go to normal mode. Back to normal mode. Luckily we have every construction finished, but we really need to get our industry back and running. Okay. Let's check it. So number one, you will go here, load fabric, unload everything else, yes. Ah! Why electronics? What? Misclick. Hmm. 
I like the uh, jumpiness of this interface, really. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, yeah. Money spent we really could need. Uh, but if you unload this, you can also unload this here. Not a complete disaster. We wanted to have some of these. <laughs> oh man. Look at that. Next one in line, hopefully he will behave better. Load fabric. So we are back in business, but we are very tight. Nearly the whole economy came to an hold and would collapse because we couldn't uh, buy fabric. Easy as this. No new fabric, um, no new production, no new production, no economy. Do you export, comrade? You don't export. Are we? Maybe we haven't anything produced. We have some here. So let's activate the emergency reserves. Um, emergency, emergency. Get me some clothes out of here and here. Load and load. No. Oh. <laughs> load and load. Close and close. So we have more than 30%. So let's make them empty. Yep. Having not treated well the good old do what can go wrong will go wrong in Soviet Republic. So here we are. Um, let's close this factory temporarily. To keep the ball rolling. Okay. So a new pump it, <laughs> it will be. It shall be. Happiness is not so high, what is going on on this front? Maybe it's because of the uh, crime issue, which is not sufficiently dealt with. It can push down the happiness. So we have an avalanche of problems running on here. Let's... No... 50. Do we have maybe people who can't move in, but... No, we don't have. Um, on the bright side, we have stabilized our academic situation. Yeah. Do we have a specific block where the happiness problem is? Let's see. So really don't want to uh, create another problem. 72. 72. 
80, ist gut. 70, 70, 70. Okay. So they have all the, the same problem or nothing special. Up. Church, your problem. Meat. Didn't they find a way? Yeah, there are many trees now. Uh, maybe comrade couldn't find a way to the distribution. So meat is there, comrade. That one is also not good. We need to reorganize the uh, cover toll situation in a short while because uh, we always need one access to the supermarket so the policeman can investigate, uh, which wasn't the situation before. Ruble zero. They are producing still. I think you are now taking something to the border. Yes. Are you served by the office? Yes. So he will uh, pull a full load out. Eight thousand ruble. Yeah, what a pain, what a pain. You see, making the game prettier, not so functional, needs nothing. Were the trees hurting our pump? It's the only thing we, we added. So, other monuments. Ah, Comrade Stalin, we think it's ugly head, out from the past, sabotaging our republic. <sighs> very valuable, uh, 10,000 uh, ruble, yeah, very valuable. I hope the they um, the motor fabric is here enough so the comrades do we make maybe a change of plan to conserve some fuel let the only import import one thing and don't export the other thing. Because he's running around empty. Problem is that uh, I also pulled out here the the clothes, so they were not pushed out to the warehouse. Same amount of speed. Need to stop the emergency here. Don't load, don't load and hope for the best. Can we do something else? Stabilize our situation. Could buy Western goods and sell them for the Soviets. Um, also be a possibility. So I really don't like it. We still are in business. Not good business, but business it is. Mm. How painful.
and we will have a prison which is non-functional because we cannot stock them up uh, we will have problems here also hopefully not too fast they also will not get stocked up uh, if we have no money really bad situation really bad How much do you have? Oi, oi, oi. Yeah. Mm, let's activate some emergency reserves also. Um, comrade flatbed. Should go back here and I want to import some steel load. No, let's wait for him. Import some steel to uh, get our pump up and running again. What a damn god, goddamn trees blocking our input of water! Unbelievable. Where is he even? Oh, there is he. What do you pumping about? 86%. Ah, I think it's the influence of... Uh, small influence of pollution. We were simply too successful here. This business. God damn it. Yeah, higher water quality, but we have 86%. Sort of way. What now? Higher water quality. Maybe we need to throw some more away. Throw it away. Still no good water, but the pump reported otherwise. Pumpy. It was 86 or not? Don't know. Okay. No fabric for you, comrade. And yeah, most likely the the high pollution ticked us over. Oi, oi, oi. Oh. Prisons up and running. So let's try to get it filled. No good, no good. I'm buried. Because if food runs out, uh, happiness is moving up, I think. Let's reorganize them. So, um, You are out of food. Hmm. You go to the border, unload anything, and 
go. Yep. No, maybe go. Yep. Delete this one. Delete this one. Go here. Get rid of your um, assignments. Okay. And your new job will be food. <laughs> I think. So you load on this. You load only food. Unload everything else. Also, lack of food here, so please take your turn. Hopefully, <laughs> um, and you wait at the border until you are loaded because it's really important. So you eat alcohol. Maybe uh, you need to make a break. Hopefully you do. Have some and buy some. Problem is really my economy needs some wiggle room to work and this one we just wasted. Or better I my pump. <laughs> uh. And the sowing season will also uh, be not successful this year because of this. Ah. Can buy western harvesters. Also would be a plan. Load steel. Unload steel. Simple as that. By Western Harvesters. <laughs> yeah. By Western Harvesters. But I uh, don't know how fast we can recover from the situation. Stink. One, two, three, four. We could redirect our uh, imports of, also some imports of, uh, yeah, this one we could do. Um, let me finish this, and after that I will finish something else. So let's let's uh, start with Plan B. Which is you, comrades, change of plan. So you are now running around half empty, half full. It's just not a super duper great situation. So we change it. Hopefully, it will not disturb anything. Uh, we are here in the line. Delete this. Need that. We are also threatening our uh, power. Oh my god. No. We will not change it. We have no, no wiggle room to change this. Uh, but 
what we can change is uh, we wait until unload here so they don't running around like madman. Oh, I'm really a little bit annoyed. Okay, prison is working. Hopefully it's a little bit... No, it isn't. Uh, yeah. This mm, comrade... Reset... Comrade, press reset. Let him finish his job, which was deliver some alcohol. Okay. And it's how we get out of this hole, I think we will see it next time. See you, comrades. Bye.